Good morning, good evening, good afternoon. <laughs> Day 15. Day 15 right now. Time's about four past seven. Getting lighter outside. And yeah, we're going to go for a run today. It's meant to be legs, but I want to try. My foot hurt the other day when I was running. So I want to go test it out. See if I've actually damaged it. But I want to get minimum 5k. For some reason in my head, I'm saying to myself 10k. But 10k takes like an hour and a bit. I don't know if I could even be bothered to do 10k. I can't be bothered to do it. It's a lazy mentality. Right, before I go on my run, this is the chart load up. Let's see. Gold. Overnight. What it did. Obviously, buys there. We're going to see it come up. We sold here, previous highs. Okay, so gold, we've touched down here again. Previous highs, previous highs. Lows are here. The low of the range is there. So I'm going to go for a run. We actually call these buys too. I'm going to go for a run, see how price reacts off here. If it respects, then next sales are at 665. But this is a good point for gold to sell off, but I'm gonna wait, hold it out. If we touch back up here, then I'm gonna jump in sales. And then obviously we're selling back down to 2,600. But yeah, might try and stay away from gold today. Let's just see how the setup takes place. I will right, wait for sales to take place. Ah, we're still in sales as well at 2671. We uh, we're still holding, which is good. But obviously re-entry wise, we want to get back in. And yeah, with this uh, 5k run or 10k run, probably won't be 10k, can't lie. Uh, it's just, I can't be bothered to run. If I'm honest, it's cold. I don't want to do it, but I'm just going to get it done and dusted and then get on with my day. 5k is quite, it's not far, but it is just long. And it's all right if you're doing it with someone, but when you're by yourself as well, it's just boring. No headphones either. Apparently, it's good to run without the headphones as it's just a distraction when you need to battle battle for it. But yeah, I'm gonna get started anyway. Do some stretching and then get going. Ah, try and just do a 5K -er. Let's go. Day 15. I've already done a K. I'm running quite slow. About six minutes per kilometer, which is pretty damn slow. However, I'm on an uneven floor, which could be injury prone. However, and I'm just taking it slow. Just can't be fucked really, but I'm getting it done. And uh, just doing some fucking cross country. Feel like I'm back at school. I'm also running on mud uneven mud it feels like i'm running in sand like honestly i feel like i'm running on sand it's really difficult look at my shoes however we keep it moving ah, you can put your nose out for your mouth uh, hello Oh fuck, don't know if something just flew down my throat. Something just flew down my throat. I'm about to come up to the 5K mark now. I'm just gonna stop there. But, I said to myself, Saturday morning, I'm going for a 10K. And if I'm doing 10K and it's easy, I'm gonna go for the 22K, which is a whole fucking marathon. Yeah, man. Fucking two and a bit weeks in, we're already fucking doing 20K, imagine that. But yeah, basically, about to hit 5k. It's been raining, it's been hard weather, but we get it done. I've got 0 0.10 kilometers left. I'm gonna fucking turn back and sprint. You ready for this? current trade that we've got going on here. I'm expecting sales or here. So I'm gonna add an alert, which I get a ping on my phone. Just come back from the run. Wait for that to happen and enter in sales. And then we're in, holding. So fingers crossed on this trade. Hopefully it goes well. Basically, 
turning into a full-time British gas employee. Can't shower because for some reason there's no hot water. I've been, I've been upstairs and to the boiler room. I tried to make my magic. It's weird because the tap, the hot water's not working, right? No hot water in the tap which means there's no hot water in the radiators to heat up the house. The underfloor heat in here, it works. Now that could be electronic. I can't even shower. Luckily I've got the warehouse, but let me try. I'm gonna see what happens when I get back. Let's see, fuck knows. Let's see if that works. Right, I've gotta go get Ted's food now. Fuck me, my hair is so greasy. Ugh. Disgusting. What hat we got here? A Miri hat, let's not wear that. It's also a Miri, but it's a little bit less plain. Fuck it, it'll do for now. Fingers crossed that starts working now. Anyway, let's go get some dog food. You hungry? Come in. Let's play with his ball. I'm gonna play with him for a bit. Coffee's been secured and finished. That's a W for the day. Gold cells running in a little bit of profit, which is very, very nice. Still holding on our FTMOs. Got a couple other people signed up on the passing. Basically, I pass people and then we split the profit uh, at the end every two weeks on FTMO. Funding pairs, the prop firm I'm launching is underway, so we'll be live in a couple weeks, two weeks, three weeks max, which is good. So make sure to check out because there's a giveaway going on at the moment, which is uh, 25 times 10k accounts. So I'll put the link in the comments or the description. Check it out, make sure to share, do everything what it says and you'll be entered. If you want a challenge right now, comment, say funding pairs, and like the video, subscribe too, and I'll give a few of you, I'll, I'll reply back in the comment section and give you a code to redeem a 10K account. I haven't been able to fix the hot water. Fucked it. Don't actually know what's wrong with it. Um, just sitting here watching gold, as you can see. Waiting for it to smash our take profit, which would be very, very nice. Checking out the YouTube analytics. Thank you for all the support, by the way, because we're going crazy. I just looked at the views, the comments, the like. The channel is starting to really pick up. And it's day 16. I did day 15 yesterday, which is coming out, I believe, tonight, which was yesterday for you guys watching now. But yeah, that's crazy. I'm just like reminiscing over like the last two plus weeks and it's like, you know, the views are going up, support's going up. My skin's so bad today though, Jesus Christ. Starting to lose weight as well, I've seen it from like the first video, actually mad. From the first video, let me show you quickly. I must have, surely, I'm not sure, but whatever. All right, food today, first meal of the day. It's around half one. Got a jacket potato tuna that the missus has done. Let's go, get the protein in. Currently TP1 just smashed for 100 pips, which is plus 5% in the platinum and free trading group. Funding pairs is launching Monday, the 7th of October. Phase one's gonna be 8%, phase two's 4%. With MetaTrader 5, thank God, it's here, it's coming. I'll put all of the socials in the description. Make sure to check all of it out. They're gonna be running giveaways, pre-launch giveaways and launch day giveaways. So you have a chance to get involved on the challenges and try and get funded with the firm. Massive news, massive, massive news. Holding the sales as well on my FTMO account. Let's see if we get a pass. We're currently plus 100-ish pips up. Right, just got in the gym. Oh. Jeez, don't know who's been sitting on that. We're in for the legs, baby. In for a nice little leg day. 
after the 5k run this morning. I was umming and ahhing about Jim, I can't lie, but I've got to keep my streak up. Okay, so uh, you can't actually see, but just doing my carbs right now, 30 kg. Um, currently, gold is at 2640. Uh, holding to 2620. Uh, 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 come on, big fucking trade today. When I get back, I'll show you the markup. But yeah, just got to do leg press and then I'm finished for the day. 5k run and leg smashed in the same day. Abs, then sauna. I've got to start shredding this off. I'm still, I'm still quite, I've, I've got layers of fat still. If you can see, got all this still to get off. It will come. It's only two weeks in. We're only two weeks in. And don't worry, I feel, I feel fat. I feel lazy. I deserve this anyway, because I did it to myself, so to get myself back into shape. It's gonna be a hard journey, but we're gonna get there. And I'm documenting the whole way, I don't give a fuck. All right, I'm gonna make this my last set. 25, 20, 15. So in total, we've got 60 on this side, 60 on this side, 120. Remember, I've just done workout and also did a 5K today. Come on. It's currently on 55 degrees, got to make its way up to 70. Gonna be in here for about 25, 30 minutes, I reckon, just because the heat's not up to the max temperature. So hopefully I should be able to survive in here for a longer period of time. But yeah, legs done, 5K done, and gold's absolutely melting. What a day. <sighs> some days are different, some days are hard, some days are easy, but with this challenge, it's just making sure that you, you just get it done no excuses do you have to train every day probably not it doesn't make a difference how you feel it's non-negotiable you get it done no matter what no matter what's happening in your life no matter how you feel you just go and get it done and uh it's just an accomplishment after you do it you tick a box come on just got back home as you can see the chart is loading up on the 4g wi-fi bash Obviously, we got in again, so there's no SL being hit. We are currently holding out for a take profit down here, which is a very nice take profit. Ignore, should we say ignore this? It's not actually valid. It is an area where price can react off, but it's uh, it's not valid because liquidity grabs down here, news pushes back up, so we're gonna retest onto the lows. So we're holding out the trade still. I am currently holding at 26.61 entry, which is a good entry. Better than what actually I actually sent out. I sent out a 26.60 TP1 smash, holding for TP2. Dog walking time it is currently half five. I can't wait to walk this dog and then be done with the day because I'm fucking ordering a Nando's. I'm ordering a Nando's tonight. We are going in. We deserve a Nando's. We deserve a Nando's. What we have in is the question. Probably chicken wrap, because healthy with no peri peri chips. Oh no, it's it's painful, but as to make you have to make do, you know, you can't you can't do everything. You can't have everything. You can't have 
you know, you substitute the chips with a chocolate fudge cake. It's one of those things. 